I take a lot of things into consideration before heading out to do my night photography these days. Right now we're in Moab, Utah, which is actually one of my favorite places in the country. How fun. If you see an image from this area, you can easily identify it's like no other place in the world. When I head out on a trail to start my night photography adventure, it usually starts a little before the sun sets. I really enjoy just hiking through the landscape, doing these solo adventures, and it's just been a place that I feel I can always come back to and still enjoy it. On my first trip out to Moab, I went out to a popular arch, and there was probably you know, 30 or 40 photographers and people just kind of lined up. And I noticed that as soon as the sun had set, everybody took off. I decided to stick around to do a little bit of night photography. And I'd had so much fun that I didn't realize it was now becoming daylight again. To me, that, that only adds to the adventure. As I was hiking back down the trail, I started to see people coming back out to capture the sunrise. It kind of made me sit back and laugh, realizing that everybody else was just sleeping through what I was experiencing, and the fact that I had it all to myself, I think made it even more special. What kind of makes it all worth it for me is when I share an image, somebody will comment back and they say, wow, I've lived here my whole life and I've never seen this before. And that's one of the most rewarding things for me, to kind of give people a new perspective on places that maybe they've lived their whole life. Text Whitney. What do you want to say? Got some epic photos. See you soon. I think it's important to follow your dreams, no matter what they are. Once you achieve a goal, it makes everything else in life seem possible. My name is Travis Burke, and I'm an outdoor adventure photographer. Mm -hmm.